because I can't see from here. All right, so test tube number one, we have our water, 10 milliliters, and we're gonna pour it in to our test tube. That's a little drop, okay? Um, on, if you scroll further down, you have a chart. It says data collection and observation. So scroll down for test tube number one where it says description of conditions. It looks like this. Where am I? Okay, this is your chart. This way. Okay, under description of conditions for test tube number one, you are going to put 10 ml, 10 milliliters water. 10 ml water. Yep, the table. Yep. That is what? Hold on. I didn't ask for it yet. Okay, double check the person next to you has 10 ml water in their description. Just because Miss Dean's not in here. She would be my checker. All right. Dennis, what were you going to say about our next one? Okay. So this one, we're not only adding the water, but we're also adding sugar. So I have pre-measured here two grams of sugar. So we're going to put it into our second test tube. I know. All right, so there's our two grams of sugar. Okay, it looks like just regular sugar. And we're gonna add our 10 milliliters of water. Well, I wanted to put the sugar in first so it wasn't hooked on the sides. If I put the water in first, then some of the sugar might hook too the wetness on the sides of the test tube. So that's why I put the sugar in first. So there's our balloon on our water. And then we're gonna put our balloon on our shaken water and sugar. So again, on your chart, test tube two, 10 ml water, two little g for grams, sugar. Okay, again. Test tube two, description of conditions, 10 ml water, 2G sugar. Okay, same thing. You can flip flop them. Okay. Now our third one asks us to put in our yeast. It's very staticky right now. So we're going to put in our one gram of yeast. I'm going to put the yeast in first. It's like hooked to the bottom of this. Jaden, zippity zip. All right, so that's about our one gram of yeast. Gotta measure out our water. Whoop, too high. Anybody know what this is called? Pipettes, right. Did you ever see the short film with Piper? The little bird through Disney, Pixar film? Because Piper, Piper birds have like a beak like this because they peck, peck, peck at the beach. So there's little birds that run real fast, like right down the water. Okay, and we'll shake this up. Okay, so there's our Yeast with our water. Can we make bread? Bread. At home. I don't have it. You know 
want. I do have a bread maker. Mm. Actually, that would be a science experiment that goes right with the yeast. We'll see. Well, hold on, because they have to write down. All right, so you should have written down for test tube three that we did 10 milliliters of water and one gram of yeast in your chart. In your chart, description of conditions, test tube three, you have 10 milliliters of water and one gram of yeast. And then in our last test tube, we're gonna put everything. We're gonna put our two grams of sugar, our one gram of yeast, two grams of sugar, just like we put in test tube two. <coughs> 10 milliliters of water, the water never changed. Same 10 milliliters. In test tube two, we put 10 milliliters of water and two grams of sugar. Test tube three was 10 milliliters of water and one gram of yeast. And in this one, we have the water, 10 milliliters. We have one gram of yeast. And then we have our two grams of sugar, okay? So this is what it looks like before I add I just kind of shook it up so the yeast and the water are in there, or the yeast and the sugar, okay? And then we have, give a little, a little shake, okay? And then we're putting our balloon. Okay, so that's four, three, two, and one. Okay, so what I'm going to do now, do I have an extra iPad somewhere in the middle, is, um, no, I need a, the one that's not the Okay, so what we need to do is, after five minutes, we're gonna make some observations. So they've been sitting there already for like 30 seconds. So I'll do it for like 4.30. Um, and we're gonna make some observations. And then after another 10 minutes, we're gonna make some more observations, okay? Um, what do you think are some uses, since we were talking about yeast, I know somebody already said that they, um,